Hey there, everyone. It's all the Angry Nerd again, and we are back with some more Walking Dead. Uh, and today we are going to be finishing episode 3 of The Walking Dead, so let's get started. But alright, back on episode 3. Um, they, I forgot to tell them that I was a murderer, and that I killed that one, uh, that one person, so... Uh, hopefully that won't come back and bite me in the ass, because, uh... Last time I played this, I remember I told them when I had the chance, because, um, I didn't save Doug, I saved Carly. And she pretty much was like, oh yeah, um, you should tell them, or whatever. But, yeah, here. We are gonna get back into episode 3. And later tonight, we should, uh, me and a friend of mine are probably going to do some more Rainbow Six. I have a lot of videos to edit, so I'm going to try to get on that. Because, uh, I think Wednesday I'm going to stay home because, um, teachers are going to be on strike. So I'm going to get some work done and send a lot of videos out, like, after a couple of these videos. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna send, uh, send them out, and, uh, yeah, but enough about that, let's get back in here. Probably have to go through this thing again. <coughs> Excuse me. If you guys saw this part already, just, uh, skip a little bit ahead. Is there any way to get around it? Doesn't look like it. On foot, maybe. Can't really afford to do that now. This seems like a safe area. Well, this brush will stop anything from creeping up on us. Why don't you and I go look around? Yeah, everyone else relax. Clear. Stay close to Kenny and Cat, okay? Lee, if you come across anything to drink, uh, if there's a dining car or something, I think Duck's a bit dehydrated. It's a freighter, huh? Be careful in there. What? You think there might be something dangerous inside an abandoned locomotive? That would cross my mind. But yeah, since we already talked to them uh, last episode, I'm probably just gonna worry about it. Like, it was pretty much just like, oh, um, same Ben too, it was just like, yeah, I'm happy I'm in the group. So, I'm gonna check in here, and then, like, when everybody's settled, um, I'm gonna talk to him. <laughs> oh yeah, and you guys can notice I'm on a new mic also. I can, like, fly around. And, Somebody's been living in yeah, here. Yeah, do stuff yeah, like man. that, so. Shit. Think yeah. they're gone? I hope so. But this looks recently used. Be on the lookout and have your guard up. Okay, good. Let's uh I'll take this to Cantra. Yep, for there we got the got that. The clipboard. Grab the map. Map of where the train goes. I think these tracks might lead to the coast. Okay, cool. 27 Savannah. That's where Kenny's got us headed. There you go. Everybody's gonna be happy now, but pretty much like what they said last episode was, uh, uh, Koch and them said they probably would have did the same thing, kicked Lily out of the group for killing Doug. So, yeah. And that was kind of surprising for me, because honestly, I didn't think that, um, Lily or, or I thought Doug probably didn't want to die, because, um, this game has, like, different things. Like, I thought he was gonna, like, stay, or he's just, like, one character or something. But, yeah. Okay. Take a little peeky peek. Take the big... okay, whatever. That works. Yeah, it was really nice. 
nothing in there. Okay. Yeah. There's a dead dude in there. We got one. Walker, sitting in the chair. We got him. No need to attract more tension than we need. <sighs> Suppose we gotta look him over. Yeah. That's been blown off. Good. Don't want to waste any ammo. I'm not blown off. I but don't like, think this guy came back. Yeah. Christ. That light is blinking. Push it. Push it. Push Why not? Up, Are you fucking serious? Here, look. Oh, Jesus Christ. It's just the brakes. Okay, I'll give you that. This fucker works? Seems like it. I'll be damned. How the hell do we get it moving? I don't know. That's Mr. Amtrak over here. No clue. We found this in the boxcar back there. Whoa, is this what it looks like? I think so. This hoss will take us right to Savannah. A hundred tons of steel. Put a thousand walkers between us and the ocean, and we don't have to give a shit. I can't believe it. Uh... We just have to figure out how to get it started. Just have to figure out how to get it started. I'm sure we can figure it out. How tough could it be? Doug would have known, but we'll figure it out. That's the spirit. Man, if you could keep an eye on the girls and Duck, I'd appreciate it. I'm gonna make sense of these controls. Poor Doug. Man, this could be exactly what we need. I'm not gonna ask him about his kid, because, uh... Well, we already know what's going to happen. If, if people have seen the TV show, or, you know, if you're just tuning in, uh, if you're bitten, or whatever, you're pretty much done. So, it's just like a matter of time. Um, let's give her the water, and then we'll talk to everybody. Yeah. Where are y'all at? Okay, there you go. Uh, here's the water for Doug. Here, found some water. Oh, thank you. Perfect. He's allergic to bees. Is that right? That's all I can keep thinking about. Like, somehow that matters. It doesn't. I know. Well, I love how he I puts don't. it. He's just like, but you're it probably doesn't. Right. Doesn't fucking matter. Alright, uh... Okay, let's talk to Ben. Hey there, buddy. I got no idea how to get the engine started. That guy in the cab probably knew. Yeah, well, he isn't talking. <laughs> well, he had to learn it somewhere. Okay, so, uh, let's check when we come down. Hey, sweet pea. You okay out here? I don't think Doc feels good. Uh, yeah, you're fucking neither. bad. Alright. Uh, pretty much the same shit. Anyway, let me know if anything changes here. Ken took off in a hurry. We think the train might actually work. Trying to find out how to start the engine. How? I have no idea. <laughs> well, I someone must have known, no right? Idea. You're right. Alright. No, 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 there we go. Climb over. <sighs> yeah, sadly, like, it's gonna be a hard, like, moment for Kenny when his kid turns. Okay. Definitely pry this thing free if I can break it loose first. Shit. 
broken. There's gotta be a better way to do this. Oh, I thought I could just like hit a button. All right, fuck. I wish I could kind of walk a little faster, but yeah, you know, I don't really mind that. So he said break it loose, so probably how we're going to have to do this is, uh, grab you, we're going to grab you, we're going to smash that shit, and then we're going to come back and grab it and pull it up. Oh yeah, also this Friday, to people who are watching this, I'm going to be getting a new uh, microphone. So, there's going to be better sound quality and everything. So, yeah. Just want to let you guys know that, so you guys don't have to keep here and like, everything else around here. Um, buying a Blue Yeti microphone, that's like 100 and something bucks, so you're not going to have to hear the, like, shit. Like... Uh, like fucking like background noise from like neighbors or like people like out there or whatever so really gonna be no problem it's gonna be good uh, it's stuck we need a bunch of force to break away all this rust and whatnot before I can pry anything free oh motherfucker I thought he was gonna hit it oh I just wasted my fucking time oh that's annoying Okay, so I just want to get it in a little bit of focus. Alright, so I guess we gotta get the train started. That's what we gotta do. Yeah, it's like you guys don't have to, like, hear, like, my water or whatever anymore. Because, uh, this microphone I'm getting, it's pretty decent. It has, like, four settings. Like, a bunch of, like, attachments and shit for it, so... It's gonna be really good. Definitely, uh... Okay, yeah. There we go. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. We got a problem. What? We still got the rest of the train attached to us back there. Shit. I tried to yank the pin out, but it won't budge. Well, we ain't going anywhere until it does. It's a bunch of papers. A bunch of maps about Georgia's cities. Nothing about the train. So I guess I gotta get, like, a pencil or something. Oh, these are rotten lunch. Yeah. Right, well, I think Clementine will have something for that, so. so. I think it's more funny how everybody's just sitting on their ass, not doing anything, to be honest with you guys. Hey there. I need to get a pencil off you. There's a notepad on the train. Do you have any pencils or anything in your pack? No, I wish. Maybe in the RV. What do you need it for? There used to be something written on the notepad that I need to know about. Well, if you're not using it, I'd take it. I'm out of paper, and there's all sorts of new leaves around here. Okay, good. So, in the RV. And a difference from when you, like, actually do this with Lily in here, she kind of, like, jacks the RV, and, like, she threatens... Oh, no, I don't want to go with the goddamn RV door. No, like, she tries to, uh, threaten you, and she's like, oh, you're, you're lucky that whatever. And, it's like, she pretty much just threatens you, that's it. Like, right when you pick up the pencil, she threatens you. So, yeah, it's honestly the RV. Um, 
we're not gonna have any need for it anymore, so... Like, even, uh, even Kenny, he says to, uh, like, Lee after when she takes it, he's like, oh, I, we didn't really need it anymore, it was gonna, it was gonna break down anyways. No, I didn't, oh, okay, I went the completely fucking opposite way, again. God damn, I'm getting my shit mixed up and turned around upside down. Yeah, she just, like, threatens you, and she's all like, uh, yeah, like, uh, I'd kill you, and then whatever. Like, cause in my previous playthrough when I played this, uh, I tried to be a bit more, like, nicer to everyone, but it was really hard. There we go. Perfect. You can read it now? Yeah, should be able to just follow the steps to get the engine on. Sounds good. Now you're acting like my friend. When I fucking told you I was a killer, you were like, mm, I don't like you anymore. Okay. Up. No. Damn it. Nope. God damn it. Down. Up. A little bit of lag going on here. Up. I think it's like... Yeah. Just like a slot. Son of a bitch! Whatever you did, let the dash up! So far, so good. Righty. There. Nice. Now we're talking. I think we got everything in here, yeah, now we need to head out. Now we need to head out and see what the fuck's going on in here. Oh no, I don't want to do that shit, my bad. I found out how to do it. Okay, one. Engine's ready. And give it a two. Ah, there we go. Holy shit! We're golden! Uh, yeah, we are. Yeah, we are. Golden. Man, feels good. Let's fucking enjoy this. Yeah, this is fucking Mom, enjoy. Let's see if she'll move. I'm gonna give a little push. Give a little push, push. It's all yours. Crank this bitch. Damn it! Of course, we're still attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck? Get us unstuck? Yeah. Sounds good. We're loose! You touching my stuff? What the fuck? Who the fuck are you? Uh, I took the map of the train routes. I took the map of the train routes. That's fine. Oh, hey, thanks. Really? Thanks, yeah. bro. I got them all right up here. Okay. I guess it's no worse for wear. Name's Chuck. 
Charles, if you fancy. What's up, Chuck? Lee. That your crew outside? Yeah, it is. Yeah. And the guy up in the cab? Yep. Him, too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? But I couldn't force myself <laughs> to do it. Ah, uh, Chuck, he's a funny guy. He's still kind of freaking me out. Train folk will do that. Already met everyone outside. They all warm to me right quick in direct sunlight. Alright, let's ask the crew about Chuck. You met Chuck? Yeah, you like yeah, it. He's okay. I did. It's so nice to meet someone normal for a change. He gave us candy, Ben too. <laughs> Ben, look at him. He looks so funny. Uh, welcome. Welcome. Thank you. You met Kenny? Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for sure. <coughs> Fucking pussy. I'm awful sorry your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit as a fiddle in no time. And I can offer y'all whatever I got, although it ain't much. Thank you. We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on that? Stay with us. We'd like the company. Yeah, come on, Kenny. We need more people here. We just left Lily in the shit dust because she killed Doug. We kind of need a new companion here. All right, hey Clem, how you doing? Hey, sweet pea, that candy Chuck gave you, it taste okay? It was really good. No funny aftertaste? No. Train's cool, huh? I guess. It's scary, kind of. See how fucking Ben's doing. What's up, bud? How you doing, Ben? I'm watching the girls and not working on a mega cool train. What do you think? You got candy. You shut the fuck up. I didn't even get candy. <laughs> fucking Doug. How's Doug? How's Doug? I don't know. Tired. Which could mean a lot of things, right? Yeah. His body's probably yeah, fighting whatever's in it. Exactly. Would you have left Lily back there? On the side I'll of the road like that? Like, yes, we... to do it. Yeah? We have to have lines. Yes, I would have left her. Okay, then. Has Clementine said anything to you about Doug or Duck or anything? I'm worried about it. No. That little girl is a puzzle. Yeah, she is. Poor Doug. God, where did yesterday go? Down the shitter. He was a fucking... Fucking goddamn bandits. You were standing right there. Are you doing okay? Uh, it was horrible. You're gonna say the same thing. It was horrible. It was. It was awful. One of the worst things I've seen yet. Like one of your I'm sorry kind of you went. Oh my god, Clementine had to see it. I liked him very much. He'd spent some time in Belgium. Where your family's from? Yes. Even further away now. I better get back to it. Hey, Chuck. Hey, Chuck. Honey. Why are you alone? Why not? Seem to be doing all right. Okay, or you can just find him. Be a douche. I'm sorry. I do like being around y'all, actually. It's nice. You caught us on a bad day. Mm. You still got a couple of kids. And this one's got a good spirit. That's some kind of something. Uh, where you from? Where are you from? You live around here? Georgia boy. You saw where I live. I'll talk to you later. Hope so. Yeah. Well, 
Hey, there, Ken. So that's it? We're cut loose? Yeah, we're good. Seems that way, yeah. Out of here. Great. Fuck Macon, we're done. We don't got much left, so just gather whatever you have. Oh, that's a good thing. We're fucking leaving. Like, we're right. Eat a... Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. Don't find nice anything better school. for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. Duck's sick. Get on the train, Clementine. Hey. Hey, you, you watch your goddamn fucking She's mother. She's getting sicker. Fucking Let me look at him. You don't fucking shoot Clementine like shit. We can't ignore this. We can't ignore this. Come on, look man. at the kid, Kenny. This, this is your kid. This is happening. Ain't shit happening. And if it His were, what can we do here? Space is we like the train white and we shit. find something better. That is the plan. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. It's talked through. Get on, cat. Yeah, look at him. He looks like I'll shit. I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. Or I'll beat some sense into Kenny. Usually, yeah, you gotta get through to some people. You gotta show them the fist. You gotta fucking you gotta goon them a little bit. But all right. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Um, I'm really liking my new cam. It's it's really good. Like I got my face up here. Like it doesn't like push back anymore. Like I, I really like that. It's good. Definitely for like ten bucks. Um, <laughs> I'm definitely really liking this cam. It's because uh, I was gonna go get like a more expensive one or whatever. Like I might do that when I get more money. But for right now. And for where I work too, like damn, like good quality, really good quality. And sorry for rambling on about that stuff, but uh, yeah, in the next episode we're gonna talk to Kenny about uh, being a dick to Clementine, and we're we're gonna have to address Duck because uh, this Duck situation needs to get fucking finished. So uh, I hope you guys have a great day. Honestly, I think this is one of like my favorite levels in the game. Oh, I hate you guys so much. Oh, I hate you guys so much right now. Oh my god, I hate you guys so much right now. Oh my god, fucking move back. Thank you.